Well, what is up, Crazy Axe, and welcome to the Asylum. You're now in Crazy Studios, and we've got Mail Call. So we're going to dig into it. But first, decided to wear one of my newer shirts. I love this. There's two meanings to it. It's alright, because I'm saved by the... Ding, 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 ding! The bell. You're saved by the bell. Or the oh, the first reality television show, Saved by the Bell. All right. Well, I'm sure you guys all love that. It's time for the first ever BAM Gamer Box. I did decide to go ahead and check this one out. Uh, I believe they did announce for the first two boxes there will be a signed uh, Funko Pop in there. So if you want to subscribe, check out the links down below. And also, too, as I said, this is now also Crazy Studios. If you've not checked it out, that is at facebook.com slash groups slash crazy studios. Studios with an S, crazy with a K. And uh, the reason I tell you to check that out is uh, not a huge gamer. Uh, I do like some of the, you know, like, what is it, like, comp, 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 I can't even say, what is it, the, the code? Up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right. Uh, Compow, com Compai code, Old uh, Contra code. I worked in a couple other games. I remember, uh, and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, if you pause the game on the Game Boy, that one also worked there too. But, uh, so yeah, some of the stuff I might not necessarily be big into, the franchise or the game. Um, and I mean, they might be big franchises. Like, I'm not a huge Zelda fan, and a lot of people love Zelda or Fan Final Fantasy. So, you can find some of the stuff on there available to purchase. So if you want to check that out, go to that website and uh, see what's on there. There will be stuff from BAM boxes as well as other subscription boxes from the past and just other neat stuff that I find out there. So the first item is our pin. Of course, I recognize that guy. That is, uh, isn't that from Mike Tyson? Is that Mike Tyson Punch Out? This pin is limited to 250, so it is one of the uh, rare pins. You'll see the Funko Pop staring at me, and I'm trying not to look at it. Next time I see, I just saw the back side. It looks like a badge of some sort. Oh, speaking of Zelda, I believe that's where that comes from. <clears throat> so that might be one of those items you'll find on that website. So, uh, again, facebook.com slash groups slash crazy studios. Crazy with a K and studios with an S. We've got our pen, not pen, our... Uh, Card that you've been doing a training card. I mean, I guess it's a game, but I would put this more. And it's funny, they're like some of those items that are in uh, dual categories. We're going to be more determining off their uh, what category they're bigger in. I put that in the geek box. I think that's bigger there than in the gamer box. We got our card, so let's go and take a look. See if we got anything. I always have these little. A lot of scratchers, and I always put them up before I do these videos. And for those wondering, this is I got a couple of these. The uh, Oregon State Fair uh, makes uh, scratching them nice and easy. All right, so oh, first item: 4K TV. Or $4,000. Uh, either we're gonna. <laughs> no. um, of course, you have to match two of them. Oh, and it looks like I'm already out because I got the PlayStation 4. You have to match all three, and there's only three boxes. So the second. Oh, I would have. I would have thought I would have won. I had scratched this the other direction. So there's only three boxes, so you pretty much have to match all three to win. And it's always been like. I mean, I did win one, so I had all three match. But every other time, it's been three completely different items. Had I scratched it from this side... Oh, no, not if I had scratched it from this side... PS4? PS4... I would have thought I would have won the PS4. I would have been all excited. I'm glad I went from the other direction, because typically do go the other way. Okay. So it feels like the print... It 
is our print. 35 of 2200. And then we have our Funko Pop, Crash Bandicoot, signed. Of course, they are now all uh, Beckett authorized. But see, it's funny, like, they don't put on there who signed it. Like, I wish they put on the uh, actual COA who signed it. Okay, so, of course, we got the cheat sheet right here. On the cheat sheet, autograph Funko. We are proud to present you Crash Bandicoot Funko Pops, signed by Brendan O'Brien, the original voice of Crash Bandicoot. Uh, be on the lookout for one of the variant uh, pops. And then we have the uh, fan art pen. Uh, Jab Jab Hook artist Brian Romero features 1987 Punch Out of these pens are a no all of these pens are a knockout but keep your eye out for the other two variant so that is the regular one of course we did get that variant right there you can't get i am mike tyson i am mike tyson probably a more rare one to get then we have the fan art print uh the fan favorite crotus and his son in this God of War fan art print. Keep your eye out for the variant. Uh, of course, now we got the higher one, so we didn't get a variant. What is the card? It looks like there's a variant of the card. Yeah, let's say we got the regular one. The other one has more of a yellowish hue to it. So then we got the uh, prop is from Legend of Zelda. Get your hands on Link's. Helian Shield. And lastly, we have the Artist Select card, which was of Batman. So that's all the items this month. If you do want to subscribe, get your own BAM box, check out those links down below. Also check out that website where you'll see some of this stuff, as well as stuff from past boxes out there. And until next time, stay crazy, my friends. I'll see you back here real soon.